Hello, welcome guys, welcome guys to another tutorial from Classic Games United. This is your host Metroplex and today we're gonna mod Far Cry 1. So today we're gonna use two versions, the GOG version and the retail version. Alright, uh, I already have the Ubisoft version um, installed already as I will show you all. Just in case the devs wanna give me copyright, I have purchased the game on um, Ubis um, Ubisoft, but I used the FC mod loader to play the game online. As you can see, I use this to play the game online, and this requires a fresh copy of the game, so I cannot mod this. I cannot mod the Ubisoft version. So yesterday I went and I download these versions, the GOG version and the DVD version. All right. So I will be installing the DVD version first, and we will be using this mod. We will be using this to mod the um, DVD version. All right. Um, just now. Just now. This is for the DVD version. All right, we'll be using a different patch to excuse me to um. So this will be this all of this will be for the GOG version. All right, so let's get started. I will install the DVD version first. Just now. So you will need um, Demon 2's lead to mount the files. So the, I will put the link in the description for these games. For the games. So remember to support the devs and buy the game. This is for educational purposes only. Alright. So once you have Demon, Demon, no, you will need um, you will need this virtual clone drive to install the game, or you can use Demon 2's lead. But virtual clone drive is the most easiest, so you just mount it, mount it. So no unmount it, that's now. Unmount. And you will clear. So once you have this installed, virtual clone drive, just go to this and right click and mount virtual clone drive d mount it and then you will have this all right so you will click on setup exe so i'm showing you from start to finish how i install the game and after i'll show you how i'll mod the game it's been a while since i mod for a cry one so i might make a lot of mistakes but Let's see how things goes. Alright, so make sure and install it. One thing about my tutorial guys uh, is the best on YouTube, I can see that because I show you all everything from start to finish. I show you all, all the mistakes, all the errors, and I show you all how to fix the errors and mistakes and get the game working. Alright, so just get on with the tutorial. We have to install the game. But sometimes you may have errors um, while installing the game. So click next, accept, next. Let it install in this folder, the default folder. Click next. Choose your language, French or English. For me, it will be English because I speak English. All right. All right. So this is good to go. Click next. Do not install this. Um, I mean, you will have to install this, and you will. You don't need to install the Acrobat Reader, but make sure and install DirectX 9 because this is required to run the game. All right. If you install this, then the game wouldn't run. You could insp install the Acrobat Reader if you want. Let's so we'll install that. Click next. All right. Just wait, wait, wait. OK. 
parent install click next 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 install all right click that don't show this again close that off and then install the game all right so i'll have to make a cut here and i will be back when the uh, game is fully installed so so now let it um just remove the applications once it reach halfway um i may cut the video so just have patience Wait, 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 wait. This is for all the Far Cry 1 lovers. If you want to play the game in HD, we will, this is, we'll be using the Far Cry Classic mod for this first um, modern session. The second one. Get an error here. Just now. Okay, we have, a, we have an error here, right? Just now. So to fix this error now, just now. Okay, to fix this error now. Just now. Run this as so Silver Park Tree. Run as Administrator. Apply. Okay. Okay, I believe I, I remember that the DX version you don't you don't need to uh, install it just now. So I let it um, open up. I think I remember how to install this. I don't think you should install the um, Direct X9. Okay, English. Do not install this. You don't don't install that. Just get straight to the game. Don't install it. I believe. Let's see how it goes now. It will install. So I will show you how to fix all the errors while installing the game from the DVD version. Because it's very hard to install on um on new windows. Alright. So let me see how this goes. As you can see, it's installing now. Yep, it's installing now. So the trick is to don't install the DX9. Do not install the DX9 because it will give trouble. So do not install the DX9. So I will wait until the game finish install. Then we will get to the modern. Then I will end the video and I will move to part two with modern the game. All right. So. Let it install. So to fix the errors now, do not install the Direct X9. I repeat, do not install Direct X9. Otherwise, the game will give you an error and it won't install. All right. And this game, this one is a 64-bit version. So. installing very nice now nicely this is the original copy um i got this copy from the internet archives 
and internet archives is a place where you could get all sorts of stuff dumped for free so people purchase the games and they just upload it on the internet archives for others to share with others to download but of course as i show you all in the beginning that i purchased far cry one but in order to do the modding i will need to get the um retail version and the gog version because the version i have on ubisoft uses the um fc loader mod to play multiplayer and that that requires a clean copy of the game all right so the game is almost installed here everything is installed all right all right Got it register not for a cry. Alright. Alright, go to the game now. Go to the game. Be soft, attack. Make sure the game is the correct size. Yep, correct size. Nice. Everything installed. Alright, so you will, you will now go and install the patch for the game. So go to retail DVD version Far Cry 1. You could create whatever folder you want, and you have to install the patches first before you could um, run the game. Alright, so you need to install the version 1.4 patch. Wait a while. So after you install the game, install the patch. Mm -hmm. So after you patch the game. I will end the this this part and I'll go into part two and show you how to mod the game. Alright, so this is now patching the game. You have to wait a while. Must install is to fix many issues with the game. What do you mean by that? Okay, that's now. Detecting the Ubisoft version. Okay, let's try this again. Okay, what we have to do now, I will have to try and install, uninstall this one here, let's know.
Okay, I'll install that one, uninstall that one. This now. Um. Okay. Okay. Make sure that this. All right. Okay. Games. Do this for archive one folder to downloads. Right? And try the patch again. I believe you maybe um detect that I have Far Cry one install from Ubisoft, so I uninstall the, the one from Ubisoft. So uh, maybe it will detect the other one now. Because you need to patch the game to one point um four. We need to patch this re retail one to one point four. Alright, as you see, alright, next. Alright, nice. So it's no patching. Accept. So if you have the um if you have the Ubisoft version installed, uninstall it so it will be able to detect the re the, the retail version and it will install. So the reason why it wasn't it was saying newer version because I have the version on Ubisoft already installed. So I uninstall that from Ubisoft. So now we detect this one here. That is the retail version. So it's now installing the patch. Alright. So I'll show you that that's how to what to do, but how to fix all the errors that you made in Engtongta. Alright. The 1.42 patch, you need that patch. Alright. Let's now let me install the one the patch 1.42. Alright, All right, install. Alright. Alright, so we will be back for part two on how to install the, the mods, right? So I'll be back. Alright guys, welcome back to part two. So in part two we're gonna install, we're gonna burn the game, alright? So go to this version, this um, folder. You will need to download these patches. I will put this the link in the description, and you need to extract this. So you just right click. I already extracted already. Right click and click extract here, and it will extract the folder, and you will get this folder. Download the the 64-bit enhanced content. Right click and extract here. All right. So we're gonna mod the game now. And we have to read the instructions here. So I already installed it, patch 1.42. Now we're gonna install the EMD patch. Alright, so let's now. This is for enhanced um graphics, so install this. So why? Just um configure the Windows installer. It wouldn't take long. 
So this tutorial is for all the Far Cry 1 lovers that want to replay this game in high definition. I'm um, using some cool mods like the Far Cry Classic mod, popular mod. So let's wait a while it install. I am running Intel HD 4000 graphics, but let's cross. Sorry. Fingers crossed. Excuse me. For booping. Sorry. Bad manners. Sorry. <laughs> So if you all watch me tutorial and fallout, those tutorials had a lot of views in a couple of days, over 1000 view, likes and subscribers and you know, just amazing. I'm not far cry one already, but it was a long time ago and this will be like the second time I'll be modding the game. So I will, I will as I said. In part one, I will make a lot of mistakes, but we will correct the mistakes as I did in part one. I showed you all everything, how to fix the game, not installing everything. So don't worry. If any mistakes, I will correct it and I will fix it for you. All right. So just keep on watching me as we further is as we go further into this tutorial. And I hope that you all understand my English. So if you all understand my English, you all can comment in the comment section and say that you all understand my English. All right. So let's wait a while let this um install. They say it could work on Intel graphics too. Intel um yeah Intel um graphics as well. So we just gonna see. And after we we'll install the update, right? It's updating. Okay. Wow. So let's set it um update. Alright. Alright. And we will install as we don't install that, we need to install the upgrade, right? Install the upgrade. Wait a while. Yes. Let me configure the windows. It will take a while to configure. Drink some coffee by the time as you watch me. Because this tutorial is going to be very long. After I will show you how to, I will show you all the end results in the game. I will test it out and show you that it works alright. So, bear with me. This tutorial will be uploaded in 2K or 4K. Otherwise, will come up. Just wait a while, guys. I just come up. Click next. Accept the terms. Click next. Click next. So let it take its time and um, upgrade. Guys, it's first time I'm already using this AMD upgrade. So I don't know how the game will work. But we're gonna find out. We're gonna find out guys. Validating install. So let it do its thing. 
we shouldn't have any errors here let's just validate let's just do this thing have patience wait it's supposed to be installed correctly but let it validate install searching the files to see if everything is correct searching for the um the first um emd um enhanced pack have we installed the patch so let it validate and then we will get into um things all right patience have patience nice so it's installing guys you see it's installing very nice all right Just upgrade, upgrade, upgrade. So, so at the end of everything, I will show you all the end results. All right, so I show you all the end results. I will also show you all the correct settings to set in the game. Crash. That is if the game start up with this um EMD patch because it's first time I'm really using this patch. You see the 64-bit EXE has been installed here. Alright, 64-bit EXE that has been installed. Alright. Click. Alright. So let's go back to this now. Download the Far Cry Classic to the root folder. You explore all the files, yes to all. Alright, so you will need to just now. Let's open anything, go to downloads, go to here, and then you will need to. Copy this Far Cry Classic EXE. Copy this to the Far Cry folder. All right, so copy this. Okay, continue. All right. So what we'll do? We have to open this now. Far Cry. Extract it. Yes to all. As you see here, yes to all. So let us let us do its thing. Let it do let it do its thing. So this is the first modern process. So from the beginning to end, we had a lot of errors, and the errors was fixed. The HD um, 2.0 patch. Should we get one? Well, we get one error here. I 
there's no guy there's no guys okay you see you cannot open it for a cry that a fella there's no Yes now. That's no guys, right? Get extra care. See if it will work. So you seem to get a little errors there, guys. So you try to fix that. So yeah, let's go to the data folder, go to security and on. Right, so it will take a little while. Alright. Seems to be working now. Right. Okay, right. So that works. That worked. And then we will go to the DV folder now. We we'll go to the HD for Akai HD. Go to replace and replace all of this. Alright. So. Go to system CFG. Alright. It will be in Russian, change it to English. Sorry. Change it to English. The language will be in Russian, change it to English. Click save. Alright. And then let's just see here. In the origin EXC in bin 32. But that's now. Then no DVD part for that. Mm. All right. 
let me try this um i'll be back in the game guys to see if it working so i'll be back and i will show you that it's working right so stay tuned for part three all right guys this is the 64-bit exe all right this is 64-bit exe um don't start don't mind the um don't mind the white screen so when you're going to the game now go to this go to control and if you're having problems with the mouse just set everything to default and then go to main menu campaign you could choose whatever um whatever version you want choose the, the 20 the PST version and start the game and it's now so you can load the game all right so load the game don't, don't mind the wide screen for the menu that is normal because we're using the 64 bit version all right at the exe you can use the 32 bit which will be so we're now gonna all right all right as you can see it's working it's working it's working no crashing so we will go outside now okay we're not supposed to see any wild graphics any graphic issues just let me learn the song the song they will run the volume a bit outside as you can see wow look at the graphics guys look at the graphics wow no graphics tearing no um issues the game is working perfectly on the 64 exe all right let's kill some bitches everything is working fine guys don't matter the don't, don't mind the lag it's because I'm recording. It's because I'm recording, guys. Don't mind the lag. I'm recording. That's why it's moving like this. But it's working very, very well. It's only because I'm recording it, you, you will see a bit of lagging and stuff. But when I'm not recording, the game works very well. All right. Yeah, we're supposed to find another gun. All right. So that's showing that the game works very well, guys. With the um the, the mods, no matter the the lagging is because I'm recording. But I gotta show you that this this works perfectly well. As you can see, this is the um, Far Cry Classic mod. Far Cry Classic. You understand? And everything works very well. So if you want to play Far Cry um, this way, this is the way to go to play the game. Alright. So I hope that you all enjoy the tutorial. From beginning, from beginning to end, I'll show you everything that you need to do to play this beautiful game in enhanced graphics and the best mods that you will need for the game all right all right guys so this is the end of this tutorial so everything works very well the game is playing good you don't have to install a no cd patch because um once you patch the game it has removed the um the drm so you wouldn't need that as you can see enhanced graphics looks very well so we will now move to the GOG version modding. We will go, we will go on 
Muddy Gog version. So I believe I will mod that. I'll do that tutorial for another day. This is for the um, retail DVD version. And another day I will do the, the modding for the GOG version. Alright, so hope that you all enjoy the tutorial. Take care and see you all in the next video to come. Bye.